Fresno Campus Legends was my absolute favorite. Like the most fun I've had playing Madden in a long time because it's basically just NCAA football. And I had this idea in my head. I was like, bro, why are they not giving the college players X factors? It'd be so sick. I think they read my mind or EA really has just been dick riding me recently. Campus Legends, it's back in the game. It's been out for like two months. It's been a depressing time period, but it's back in the game and they gave each team three offense and three defense X factors. I'm so excited this is back. Everybody was tagging me on this on Instagram and guess what? EA unblocked me on Instagram. I'm still blocked on everything else. I don't know if some different dude runs the Instagram account, but this is a step in the right direction. That being said, EA, suck oh, and lick my dick and balls. I still hate you. I did notice this, it's kind of weird. They give you a team overall, offense overall, and defense overall, like similar to how they used to do in the NCAA footballs, but every team has the exact same overall. So the relevance of it doesn't really make any sense to me. But what it almost means to me is I think they want to expand this or possibly give teams actual overalls. I can't imagine why they would put that in there unless they had future plans to actually use it. That's what I'm hoping. That's what the optimism in my brain says. The pessimism in my brain says EA has no fucking clue. They're like, too bad we can't get current college players, bro. If I can get my boy Jalen Naylor and Jaden Reed, Kenneth Walker, bro, almost about to get Heisman. Sadly, since we lost to OSU, we won't be getting that Heisman. But uh, if I could put Kenneth Walker on this team instead of Le'Veon Bell, I think I would. Let's hop into this game. I can't wait to see the X Factors. And you guys know I was talking about this before, where I wanted to do one video where I win as every single team in one video. I was gonna do it last time, but the mode ended too soon. I didn't have time to do it. Cause that video is gonna take me like five or six hours to record. Obviously that's not this video, but stay on the lookout for like a 30 to 40 minute banger. I will have that, don't worry. Also, I'm proud to once again partner with the game-changing shoe company, Vessi, on today's video. What makes Vessi so crazy is they are 100% waterproof, snowproof, dustproof, whatever proof. You can do literally anything in these shoes. I've got a beautiful new pair right here. So in the box, I've actually got Vessi's brand new sneaker called the Everyday Move. All the shoes that Vessi sells have that weatherproof technology, but the Everyday Move has enhanced breathability, added support, all-day comfort. You really can't miss with a Vessi shoe, which is why it's very clutch that I just wear my Vessi shoes every time I walk Luna. I keep them at the front door, I slide them on before the walk, and no matter what I encounter on the walk, I'll be perfectly fine. I can walk straight through puddles, I can walk in the mud, doesn't matter. I'm gonna show off that waterproof feature right now. All right, Vessies, let's do this. I'm gonna slide my phone in here. The old sink test, yeah? She looks pretty. Moment of truth, unscathed. Like I said, they're amazing. I just leave them at the front door. I don't have to worry about anything. So check Vessi out in the link below and use my code MMG to get $25 off your Vessi shoes. Vessi also has their Black Friday and Cyber Monday deals going on right now. So check those out while you can. That's it for now, Vessi. Thank you for sponsoring, guys. Enjoy the rest of the video. MSU versus LSU. All right, so Kirk Cousins with Hot, hot Road Master? And Conductor, I have never used Hot Rod Master. Plaxico Burris, Red Zone Threat Mid and Elite. Wow, they gave Le'Veon Bell Jukebox and Backfield Mismatch. They definitely should have given him Leapfrog. I can put Plaxico Burris on posts whenever I want. Oh, that's crazy. I'm just gonna heave one, cause why not? Holy shit. Oh my God, Felton Davis! What the fuck? Kirk Cousins with an absolute rope, dude. That was a perfect ball. Oh, this is sketchy. I can't see this working well. No way. No fucking way. Oh, he's so slow. Jesus. Kirk, what do you have, 50 speed? That was embarrassing. Also, we have one of the greatest kickers of all time, Morton Anderson, so. Joe Bocci, Shalik Calhoun. I'm kind of testing my own MSU knowledge right now. I want to make sure I know all these names. There's definitely going to be a few I don't know, though. So Kenny Willekes, I don't know this one right here. I know Joe Bocci and Carl Banks. Pico for sure. Golston? Oh, shit. It's gonna be a slug out, boys. It is gonna be a slug out. He's going for two as well. I love this guy. It's gonna be a good one. Probably a pass though. Ooh, nice read. First and 10. This is the smart pass. Bell's got it in, oh. Holy shit. All right, we're going at back dive. We're gonna ride on the tails of Le'Veon Bell here. Great downfield blocking and Bell is gonna take it. That's MSU football. You gotta run the ball a lot. Oh, it's Billy Joe Dupree. I recently learned about this dude, Billy Joe Dupree. I'm staying in four verts. Actually, no, we'll go the dive here. We'll go the dive. Yup, get through him. Let's go, Bell. I miss this Le'Veon Bell. He's so washed now. It's really sad to see how washed he is. Little play action. 
Yup, get him thinking about it. I'm going Plexico. Ooh, we barely got that one off. He's only got one in the box. I feel like this dive is gonna be there all day. Oh, Bell. I lied. I gotta go for it again. Come on, Bell. Come on, Bell. Get a block. Oh, okay. He missed. <laughs> He was right there to fill the gap and he just kind of choked it. This is true MSU football. We're literally running halfback dive after halfback dive after halfback dive. I'm gonna keep running halfback dive. Look at this defense. It should be so money for me to run against. Wow, I did that horribly. I said I was gonna do it, so I'm gonna do it. Fourth and one, he's there. I broke a tackle and then I got lit up. I don't get how my five linemen don't block that better. I think he's gonna go up high to Odell again. So we just kind of got to get on it. Ooh, I guess he also has uh, Thaddeus Moss. It's not Randy Moss, it's Thaddeus Moss. Which is either Randy Moss's son or it's like his cousin or younger brother or something. I think it's his son. Yeah, I saw that though. So Carl Banks should have this. Oh, we need that. Fake spike and we're gonna get, I don't know why he ran fake spike, probably a misclick, but that's good. Fourth and 17, great defense here. All right, boys, get to the quarterback. I'll try and cover deep. Oh, we're all over that. Wait, what? Dude, low key, I think he should have got that. I can't really run the option because Kirk is so slow, but whatever, I'll try and get the pitch. Get the pitch, yup. <laughs> Wait a minute, bro, I'm not about to do this. Oh, good play. I'm going for it again, why not, right? It's there! Oh! <laughs> Let me up, Bell! Oh, he got up off the ground. All right, clean play, dude. We're killing it with a little pitch game. I do have red zone threat on Plexico Bruce. I'm gonna try it. Let's go up, baby! Red zone threat! Yes, sir! Absolutely aggro's everybody down there. Ooh, and this is the lefty kicker flip pass. Dude, it actually fucks people up so bad. Did you see his user? His user went to the right side because that's where the fake always goes unless you have a lefty kicker. If you have a lefty kicker, it goes the opposite way. Nobody is ever ready for it. And that's why we convert right there, 14 to eight. Putting the pressure on Joe Burrow was the only effective strategy we've had so far. Get there. Oh, ooh, no, you did not just do that. I'm gonna use your William Golston. He's honestly pretty fast, bro. Oh, you're not throwing that bubble, are you? Odell's open on the left side. Oh, it's Justin Jefferson. God damn, I forgot how many good wide receivers he has. He's got Justin Jefferson, Jarvis Landry, Odell. Oh, good, good throw. He dotted me up all the way down the field there. Does he kick his field goal this time? He does not, he's going for it again. Two point conversion. I'm on, I think it's Brad Van Pelt. He's gotta throw it. Ooh, Shalit Calhoun. You know, I don't expect this guy. He's playing exactly how I'm playing. Cause he could have taken his one point lead right there, but we have a mutual respect that we're both going for two every time. This is kind of hit or miss play. Either Plaxico is open or I'm not getting shit. I think he outran him. Plaxico Burris. Oh my God. Let's go. I think Le'Veon Bell is gonna be wide open here. Bingo. Le'Veon Bell in the passing game. We take an eight point lead. Here's the live betting odds, okay? Vegas has it at 65, 65. So place your bets right now. At the end of the game, is it over or under 65? And don't cheat either. He's looking for Odell on a deep post. This is what he burnt me on earlier. Yeah, he's trying to do it right now. Yup, there's the deep post. He does throw it. I read that shit like in a book, like actually. Get the pitch. Okay, Trey Wayne's got it. I think I might've gotten three additional yards. Billy Joe Dupree. How are you black and your name is Billy Joe? That is reserved for hick white people. All right, hold up. Pepper? Oh, that's a bad ball. Pepper! It's not a bad ball. It's a great ball. What the fuck did I just throw? I actually don't know why I did that. I can't kick a field goal. Me and this guy both know that that would be so lame. We gotta go for it here. Let me look deep in the playbook and see if they got anything that I really like. The only route that I think could actually score a touchdown here is Billy Joe Dupree. Uh-oh. All right, Kirk. Oh, pick up that blocker. Yes. 
Let's go for it, baby. Oh, shit. Kirk. Kirk, I don't have a shot in hell like that. Well, now I hope you bet the under. 22 to 14, LSU starting with the football. I had a class with Joe Bocci once. I mean, his triceps, number one, are the size of my head. And he has these massive tattoos on him. Okay, he throws underneath. He's got a gigantic J tattoo on his left bicep and a gigantic B tattoo on his right. And I was kind of hoping that Madden would put that in here. Like that I could see his tattoo, but they don't. They don't put it in. I didn't really expect them to though. So I'm not like really bad about it. Oh, another good playmaker. Banks! Oh, I almost got to him too. He wants this high shot to Odell. No, sir. No, you didn't. What a throw by Burrow. A cross field, cross body. I'm impressed. He's been throwing a lot of check downs. Oh, he's got nothing. He's got nothing! Oh, I was so close. I saw it developing. I just wasn't fast enough. All right, he's got to go for two. Doesn't really have a choice on this one. Let's see what he likes here. Oh, step up! Oh, you got to step up sooner. There are so many weird routes here. I'm not familiar with, like, any of these. Kirk Cousins using the wheels. Oh, that's a laser. That's a fucking laser! To Bell! Grant Delpit jumps early! He's going all the way! Dude, he thought that he switched on to Pat P and he switched on to Grant Delpit. If you bet the over, you're not out of luck yet. I'm going with the halfback dive for the two-point conversion too. I don't really know how I feel about it. Bell is there and he powers his way in! Second and 10. Uh-oh, look at Odell. And look down the middle. He had some scary open routes, but we got to the quarterback, thank God. All right, I got the middle now. No, yes, we broke it up. Jefferson can't hang on. This could be the ice that we need. Cover four, drop, show two. Just hold out right here. Oh no, I'm on the wrong dude. This is not where I want to be. Oh, that's so open. Oh, I'm on the wrong dude. He snapped it so fast, I got stuck on my D-lineman. That sucks. I think he's going to throw a check down here. Let's see. Oh, Joe Bocci! Joe Bocci with the dagger. The line is at 52. Vegas headed at 65. But I'm not done scoring yet, so don't get worried quite yet. Oh, Billy Joe, Billy Joe, step up. Ooh, he might be that guy. I think I just realized he's that guy. We're gonna do a little Vegas rigging here, you know? I got paid off by somebody in Vegas to try and score as many points as I can, so gotta do it. The double juke. My opponent would do the same for me. He would give me a chance, I believe. Plaxico, oh, he ripped it out. He ripped it out just at the end. 26 seconds left, it can still be done. I don't think this right side's open. Burrow's gonna go out of bounds after about seven seconds. Third and four. I'm coming around the edge myself. Oh no, I lied, I'm not. Oh no, not Odell. Not Odell right now. He mossed me. Dude, we might go into OT. If we go into OT, the over hits, by the way. Never count Vegas out, baby. I knew it! I knew it! Dude! It's the same thing that he threw on his first two-point conversion. And Carl Banks is gonna walk this one home with the dagger. And it ends on 60 i hope you bet the under wow 32 to 28 what a fucking game i gotta wish my boy a gg all right boys i can't wait to record that huge video that huge video i'm gonna be sitting here for like four or five hours but i'm gonna win with every single college team you guys are in for like a short you like a little netflix movie you know all right i love you boys i will see you in the next video peace out